Hello everybody, it's Google here and welcome to another Tech Play video. This is going to be a little bit different than per usual. I'm not also coming back to me explaining the deck, but I kind of am. Now, today's video is about level swarms. So we're doing a very, very simple thing. We're sending monsters to the grave, activating rekindling, and just synchro summoning the shit out of everything. We have Magma Cuneers, which are our main non-tuner monster we have raiden because we're also playing light swarms ash blossom because ash blossom a level lakeside lady because level lakeside lady lumina to revive said raiden minerva because more milling is also nice handmaiden because well handmaiden is handmaiden we have charlie the light brigade to search our uh, light swarm package harpy's feathers because we don't like back row the molten conduction field so we can actually send all of those lavals to the grave so we can resummon them Part of average because we're sending a shit ton of monsters to the grave and drawing two cards is always nice. Rekindling our main win condition, we activate it, we synchro, and we are kind of starting to laugh. Solar recharge so we can actually have even more draw power. Called by the grave because fuck you everyone, uh, fuck you, we're doing a combo deck so we would like to have not getting, uh, and we would like to have an ability that's not allowing us to get ashed. And my personal favorite super secret tech in Light Swarm decks, Brave Crewful Breakthrough Skill. And this is this is interesting because even if it's sent to the graveyard, the opponent can only negate it with an Omni negate. Because it's an effect. So it's always nice to have. Also during my turn, it's a quick play. It's a quick effect. So it's always nice to do. Uh, as for the extra deck, we're playing level dual slasher, wing Pegasus at Ignister, Zeta, Meteor Burst Dragon, Michael, level 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 Salamander. One fortune on Lady Every, which is a pretty decent tech, if you ask me. Since Every is a level 7 synchro monster that can be summoned with Lumina and Raiden, the uh, the levels cannot go into it since it needs a spellcaster. You can use it with our level tuner to go into a Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon, and the next turn, fortunately, every will just summon itself back. Which I think it's a very good play. Not to mention that when fortunately every is summoned during the standby phase, she'll boost her level by one and banish a monster on the field. We're also playing FA Drawn Dragster because level seven Synchros, Clear Wing, Moonlight Rose, Black Rose, and Double Crystal Wing. If I would change anything, it would add another Crystal Wing or some different Synchro Monsters, maybe some uh, some links, but I don't think it's really necessary. The deck is good as it is. So, without further ado, let's go into the replay. So, we're starting the first... So, the first duel is starting, and the hand looks pretty decent. We're going to start with a Sorrel. Solar Recharge, then we're going to summon Magma Cannoneer. I actually kind of forgot that it, its effect can be activated twice per turn, that's why the Hand Maiden stays. And next our opponent will summon Familiars, do a thing, Greater Nerd Fire is summoned, I am burned, and Magma, Magma Cannoneer is destroyed. But then we top deck Molten Conduction Field, giving us access to a level of Volcano Hand Maiden, which mills basically most of the deck, and we have rekindling, so we are going to go into Synchro Summon. Our Salamander is getting negated, but we also have Dual Slasher, and we are also getting Crystal Link, thanks to that. Things are happening, effects are negated, and our opponent is going to summon a Luna again. But we're trying to call by the Grave it, and Luna is trying to bounce the Crystal Link, but the Crystal Link negates and the opponent surrenders. And now the next duel, we open pretty godly with Conduction Field, Double Red Kindling, Magma Cannoneer, and Raiden. Let's see how I'm going to screw this up. We're going to start with the Conduction Field and Milling Handmaiden, and another Handmaiden, and a Handmaiden. Have I mentioned Handmaiden yet? Yeah, and I kind of screw this up by only getting one Magma Cannoneer, not two. Salamander will activate, allowing us to do some other things, draw cards, rekindling again, 
we're summoning back the salamandra so we can synchro summon into a crystal wing so we're ending with a ash double crystal wing slasher and fa john dragster and the opponent scoops so next duel what we've got double rekindling a solar recharge and so we're going to start with a solar recharge sending this minerva to the grave and we, do, we top deck conduction field which is great since we have double rekindling and uh, the maiden which is going to send stuff and we are activating our first rekindling I mean everything getting salamander salamander will uh, let us draw two cards we're having a crystal wing now we're activate lumina some back raiden raiden will trigger and here we are making a very interesting play since we're summoning uh, every getting that into uh, synchro summoning that into crystal wing ending with drawn dragster so whatever happens we're able to summon back that uh, fa not fa uh, that uh, every uh, so even though our opponent summon summoned dragoon we're able to bring back every every's effect will trigger so the opponent will try to negate it but we have crystal wing and since every doesn't target that dragoon is banished and the opponent is pretty much now well killed since uh, he tried to activate another Red Eyes Fusion, but we are able to Ash it. Every boost is a level again, we're just activating Conduction Field just because, and the opponent scoops. So yeah, that would be it for today, I hope you enjoyed this little one. Is it good? I would say it's quite decent in what it does, it also, of course can be improved, everything can be improved. And if you want to see this deck in action, please remember to tune in on Sunday when I'm doing my stream. Since, uh, yeah, the replays were kind of cherry-picked, but we will have a full hour of level sworn on Sunday. So, tune in during the Sunday stream, and I'll see you then. Chocolate, you. Peace!